Hello, and thank you for calling Real Girls. All our girls are currently out on a shoot. If this is an emergency, please press... What? Your voice isn't being heard in the media? Our girls are on their way. Hello, Real Girls. This is headquarters. We have a pink alert. I repeat, we, we have, have a pink, pink alert. alert. I've worked at two different TV stations and I can't remember ever meeting a woman producer, editor, uh, director. Youth just don't have a voice in this community, especially young women. To be a real girl means to be critical of what your intake is of media and also to be critical of what you're giving out. It's also a place where you can give back. Real Girls helped empower me by introducing me to the technologies because I'd never used a camera before. Real Girls offers year-round after-school programming for teen girls of all video production levels. So how did it go, girls? <laughs> <laughs> this is actually not the first time I've been in a cape, Real Girls related. Can I say there's the best, there's the best Mini Mart in Seattle across the street from Real Girls. Really? Yeah, I love that Mini Mart. Programs range from one-day workshops that focus on specific aspects of video production, such as stop-motion animation, script writing, or cinematography, to programs that last several months, in which participants learn camera, audio, editing, and storytelling skills to create polished video pieces. I look forward to it in the morning. In the morning, <laughs> guys. I don't like getting up in the morning, but it's something that I can look forward to and actually get out of my bed feeling good about. Additionally, Real Girls partners with youth serving Seattle organizations to offer video production camps in which teens with no prior video experience create short videos in as little as 15 hours. You can, in a really creative way, say smart stuff to, to the world through film. That's why we exist. It's important to have young women be able to voice their own opinions and voice what they wish to see in the media. Everyone's a girl and everyone's here for the same thing and not just to get it done, but because they want to learn. You turn on the TV and you're bombarded with all of these images of what women should look like and it's not representative of who you are and what your own experience is. One of the most inspirational aspects of Real Girls to me is seeing the youth never touching the camera to seeing them becoming total professionals. While they're working on this film, the girls are really in creative charge, but the mentors are definitely there holding them up and keeping them together and passing on things that they should know as problems come up. And so they're really just this great support system that really allows girls to thrive. As you continue to make your own films and tell your own story, but then you also have to give back to that community and make sure that other young women and other people are given the technologies and the experience to start telling their stories. These girls are ready for the industry. We're putting a 16-year-old girl in front of a client and having her have to be really professional at 16. And the, and the girls are ready. It's one of those things where Real Girls believes that if you believe somebody can do something, they can do it. I was working with another youth organization and I hired out one of the youth from Real Girls and had her work with me as a peer and just seeing her teaching capabilities and seeing her professionalism come out was it was it was so awesome they quite literally transformed how i saw the world and how i saw myself 
By Comcast supporting Real Girls, we're getting women in the media, and for, for us at Comcast, that's a win-win. I think we should grow. I think we should get out to more girls. I wish more people knew about us. I wish we had equipment that could help our production, you know, make it more professional. I feel like we're kind of grassroots at this point. I want Real Girls to be able to offer services in the more advanced aspects of film. It would be really cool if Real Girls became a production company. With Real Girls, I'm not afraid of anything.